Hi everyone, this is Marjorie. Welcome to my channel. Do you want to lose weight? Do you fail time after time? Do you gain it all back? If so, you're in the right place because so did I. So if you're new here, please subscribe and ring the little bell and you'll be notified whenever I upload a new video. And if you're a regular, thanks for joining us again. Okay, I'm entitling this video WTF. Okay, before you start calling me potty mouth, I just have to mention that my little granddaughter um, gave me a, a cute uh, different acronym for that. She said, where's the fun, Grandma? And I went, okay, that's so much better than what the usual WTF, which is kind of how I'm feeling. Anyway, um, I'm going to tell you briefly about my kitty because everybody's been asking and I appreciate that. He's uh, <laughs> laying over there with a snotty nose still and a pussy eye. And he did have a long lasting um, antibiotic shot that should get him through this, I'm hoping. He doesn't like to eat, but thank goodness I don't just buy everything that doctors tell me. I do my own research as well. The antibiotics should take care of any infection he has. And I purchased this lovely tiny little tube of Duralactin feline l lysine paste, which has high quality protein that helps to stimulate their appetite and do other things and uh, combat the viral aspect of the feline herpes virus that he has acquired. So that's fun, right? I mean, I'm still torn up because even though she gave him an antibiotic shot, I still have to put that stuff in his mouth a couple times a day just to make sure he doesn't starve to death because his nose is stuffed so he doesn't smell food and if cats can't smell it they're not going to eat it and to top it off if you want to know how much fun I'm really having my old dog because you all know I have old dogs he just decided to walk around the house and puke a couple times today not sick nothing wrong he just does this like once a month and he had to pick today. My guess is he's stressed and worried about the kitty too. So I'll forgive him since I'm done cleaning it up and you can hear the dryer drying everything that I had to clean up. Dog bed covers and blankets and anyway. And then he ate his lunch and he's happy. So yeah, WTF. And um, then to top it off, now this would normally be a really good thing, and it kind of is. My husband decided to go back to work for a year or two. And um, fortunately, he's able to fall back on his career, which is as an air traffic controller. He did work for the FAA. Now he's working for a contract tower. And so he decided that he'd played enough video games on his little cell phone and that he was tired of, you know, political comments on Facebook and Instagram because I blocked him a long time ago. I have opinions and I don't want to share them with anybody on Facebook or Instagram. If you want to have a real conversation, we can sometimes face to face. Anyway, I don't talk about religion or politics on Facebook. Oh, so basically, since this is entitled WTF, I just wanted to mention that at one point in time, this last week, I was down to an all-new low of 51 pounds lost. And now then, um, I've decided that my um, solution is to stay off the scale. Because I don't need to know that. I mean, WTF. Too much information. No need to stress out about that. If I knew that I had gone up, I'd probably be tempted to cheat. So at any rate, um, if I don't know I didn't have any loss, then I don't have to worry about it. I just stay right on my diet, right? Okay, so um, what do I do to counteract the stress? How do I stay on keto? I have simple food. I cooked a steak for my son and myself for lunch today. And I have hard boiled eggs and little cheeses and for Comfort food, I have uh, my Bulletproof coffee. If I'm craving something sweet, I can always put some raw cacao in it, which I'm going to do and watch the movie Chocolat tonight. And I might even put some cayenne pepper in there because I need some fun. 
right? Where's the fun? And um, hot tea and stevia and broth, you know, for your magnesium. By the way, cocoa has magnesium, so don't feel guilty. You're actually taking a superfood. And then also the broth. I get the chicken broth and I put a squeeze of lemon and some sea salt. So that's an electrolyte boost right there. It helps with leg cramps for lots of women. Um, I also take my natural calms. Anyway, and then of course, the third thing I did to combat my uh, stress was I got an Amazon order. Yay! I got a new lipstick and a new little headband for when I wash my hair, I mean wash my face at night. So just getting a little treat is always nice. So that kind of made me happy. So anyway, so my bottom line is WTF? Why do I have to worry? I know I'm still in ketosis, even if the scale doesn't say that, which I don't know because I'm not getting on the scale for another week or two until my stress level is gone. And then I will get on the scale and deal with it. In the meantime, I know keto works, so I'm staying happy. And thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and share and comment. Bye for now. See you soon.